Hello guys, Keith White on TV here, back for yet another video. Before we get into today's video, let's see if we can hit 100 likes. And if you're a Blues fan, and, and I've been watching the content the past 28 days, and you're not subscribed to the channel, then make sure to smash that subscribe button, because we are so, so, well, we're pretty close to 2,600 subscribers, and um, only about... Um, if I can count, um, only about um, 400 odd um, off 3,000 subscribers. So if you haven't already, make sure you smash that subscribe button. It helps the channel out massively. But yeah, in today's video, I'm going to be talking about the Birmingham City Takeover. Now, it's getting exciting now, isn't it? Because the, the Birmingham City Takeover is going to happen in 12 days time. So not this first day coming up, it's the first day after. There's going to be a vote, um, and I'm I'm fully expecting that vote to go through, and for Tom Wagner to be the new Birmingham City owner. What a time to be a Blues fan! We've been through some tough, tough times, haven't we? The past six or seven years since these owners have been in charge, we've not had one good season. Not one good season. They have absolutely destroyed this football club. But now we've got our football club back and hopefully it can be rebuilt from the bottom. Because we have signed five players this January, uh, not January, sorry, this summer transfer window. Um, and uh, we're obviously going to add to that. There's reports of Sanderson um, joining the football club on a permanent basis. There's a... You know, I think, well, I believe Wolves and Birmingham City are actually, you know, they're not really agreeing on a fee. Wolves wants more money, something along those lines. And, uh, yeah, all the rival fans as well that have been um, bantering us and mocking us for our failures the past couple of years, it's going to come back to bite them now because we, Birmingham City Football Club, are back. We are back. And we mean business because the last couple of years we've been a joke of a football club with absolutely zero ambition, bringing in players from League One, sometimes League Two. But now, I know Bielik technically was a League One player, but still, he is not League One quality, is he? Let's be fair, he is not League One quality. And that's the main reason why he wanted to leave Derby in the first place, to join Blues on loan and then, of course, on a permanent basis. We've got Ethan Laird, who is a brilliant Brilliant right back, the perfect Colin replacement, as I said in my video last night, talking about Ethan Led. We have brought in um that Japanese uh, winger, um, which I can't think of, I don't know what his name is. Um, I've completely forgot what his name is, but yeah, we brought in it, brought him in. He seems like a decent talent, and we brought in Tyler Roberts from Leeds. These all be all being permanent uh, signings, by the way. Kevin Long as well, and uh, the thing is with Tyler Roberts as well, only twenty four years old. Yes, it didn't quite work out for Leeds, um, for him at Leeds. But I think with Blues, you know, if he's starting game in game out, I think he can. Act, I think John Newsis can get a tune out of him. But yeah, this is just so exciting, isn't it? So I've been waiting for um, news like this. For things like this to happen, I've been waiting for about four or five years now. It's been so draining doing the videos, realising the club's going absolutely nowhere and looking forward. Now I can actually look forward to um, transfer windows, look forward to Blues games, actually look forward to Blues games. It's not been like that for so, so long. Maybe the last time I was actually looking forward to Blues games is probably under Gary Rowett. I know we had one good season under Gary Monk. But yeah, anyway, it's been Keep Right on TV. Here, make sure to like, share, and also subscribe to the channel. Let's see if we could get 100 likes. And uh, yeah, if you're a Blues fan, like I said at the start of the video, make sure to smash that subscribe button. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Anyway, thanks for watching as always. Keep Right on. It's exciting times down at Blues.